welcome to my channel this is your girl danny blue and today i want to welcome you if this is your first time seeing my face if not welcome back booze and i'm glad that you are here to support me again so if this is your first time at my on my channel make sure you hit that subscribe button join the fam bam so we're gonna jump right into this video um i have a few reasons why i canceled my sephora play subscription and i was with it for a couple of years um i want to say over two years i had the subscription and i just came to the conclusion that there was no point for it so um i wrote down why i feel like this and so if you see me looking down it's because that's why okay so the first reason why i canceled the subscription was because they always were giving out red lippies i was so tired of getting a red lippy and then it wouldn't be like it was a a a, a life-changing red it'd be like a random red um i like blue blade blue based reds because of my skin tone and those are mostly the reds that i will buy but they just be a random ordinary non-specific type red and i'm like it's the best y'all can do. I mean, at least it could something. Like, I'm so over red. Like, throw me some purples. Throw me some grays. Throw me some pinks, some oranges. Throw me something but red. Red is played out and it's not universal. Sorry. Reason number two. They kept throwing in that daggone grande lip plumper. I don't, look, y'all see my lips right? They're already plump. I don't need any more plumpness. Like, they're fine. They're doing good on their own. They do what they do. But y'all sitting up here sending me that plumper that does not plump my lips. It barely makes my lips look wet. I'm like, what is the point for this? So, like, if y'all really wanted to make it specific towards me, maybe I would have felt better about it. But I just felt like you're just throwing in extras from whatever in here. Like, I really care about these black liners reason three why are y'all steadily putting black liners in these boxes like come through with some color pop out do something gray green orange purple brown yellow like do something different like this goes back to the red lips stop trying to be trying to reach everybody instead of making it more personalized i don't need another black liner that's all i buy are black liners if i want a black liner i can go in my collection say no black liners are boring and they're dead number four i found i i felt like sephora play wasn't necessary anymore um don't get me wrong every now and then they throw in some really bomb products and i would be like these are life-changing and i would end up buying the full size but that didn't always happen so for me it'll be like why isn't this personalized why don't you make it make me feel like oh since i have this subscription you can't get this like y'all selling the boxes that's how bad it is so it ain't even like it's personalized and you can't get it like you have to subscribe in order to get these samples it was like anybody can get them so if that's the case why am i paying every month when i could just pick and choose and see which ones i want to pick out instead of you having me get the subscription box which anybody can get them which is very not exclusive what's the idea it's not inclusive you know what i can't even think right now i don't know the definitions of words right now but the point was i didn't feel like i was in a exclusive group i felt like any and everybody was able to get their hands on this and they were so no reason number five it goes back to reason number three or four it wasn't personalized so for example y'all kept sending me that um was it the law mercier caviar stick i think that's who makes that You've sent me that four times. Stop sending me the same stuff. You're just recycling it. You're recycling it. Give me a reason to want to keep getting this box and spending my $10.80 a month. Yes, the $10.80 went towards my overall spending for the year. So it'll be around $120 something dollars a month. Cool, whatever. But the point I'm trying to make is you didn't make me feel special with this subscription box there's like a lot of things you could have done you could have actually 
did dug deep, dug a little bit more and personalized the boxes better than they were. Like people would all get the same stuff. Like I saw y'all trying to change, but I'm, I'm not sold on it. I don't see any value in it at this point. And so I'm like over it. So maybe if you actually go by what people say they need, like what their needs are, I don't mean just for one or two products. I mean for everything you put in those boxes. You know their hair type, their eye color, their skin tone. Like the stuff is targeted just to them. And no regular person can just buy these boxes. Y'all might can gain a whole lot more business. And you wouldn't have to be selling them. Because guess what? Everybody would want them. Don't be just giving me stuff that you had as point perks. Make them make me feel like. I belong to a group of people that everyone isn't able to get in on. I don't like seeing my samples as 100 point perks. That was just like, ugh. Okay, my rant is over. Thanks for chilling with your girl. I just need to get that off my chest because I just was not feeling that. So I'll just be saving the $10 a month that I've been spending and just play with the products that I already have that's here. Thanks for watching. Make sure you join the fam bam. If you want to see more random rants, make sure you subscribe to your girl. And I'll see you next time.